Unless you've been living under a rock, you've probably noticed that the internet isn't what it used to be these days. Social media platforms that used to provide for the free exchange of information and the means of organizing resistance have anointed themselves arbiters of truth on a mission to protect our fragile minds from any ideas and opinions that they happen to disagree with. Controversial posts are now fact-checked, restricted, or flat-out removed. Those who dare speak outside the lines are subject to temporary or permanent banishment. Unfortunately, this trend isn't likely to reverse anytime soon. In fact, it's going to get worse. Calling them out or petitioning for change isn't going to work. These people feel validated and justified, and they are supported by a highly vocal contingent of the population that believes that dangerous ideas should be silenced, and that heretics should not be allowed any platform whatsoever to speak their minds. As such, it is imperative that we develop new strategies for exchanging ideas and organizing that do not depend on their technology. In this video, I'm going to describe a media strategy to bypass Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube that makes use of Telegram. However, the same principles can be applied to other apps. Telegram is an encrypted messaging app which ties to a cell phone number, much like WhatsApp. However, it has much more features than WhatsApp, including channels and multi-level admin controls for groups. It also has a desktop version for Mac and Windows that makes it much more easy to work with. Working with Telegram as a tool for activism is very different than old school social media because you don't have direct access to open pools of users that you can find in a search. However, the fact that Telegram distributes all messages directly to your channel subscribers or group members without censorship and without limiting distribution algorithmically makes the potential reach of this platform much more significant. Telegram also has secret chats, which provide a means of communication for activists that intelligence agencies cannot monitor. Given the level of access that social media companies grant to the NSA and other entities, this is extremely important. And if you think this is a conspiracy theory, you might want to look into the Edward Snowden revelations. Once you have Telegram installed, setting up new channels and groups is easy. Click the pin icon in the top right corner and choose new group or new channel. When you create a new channel or group, you'll be given the chance to set it as public or private and choose a custom URL. It's also worth noting that you can create a custom username for your account so that people can contact you without knowing your phone number. Once you've created a channel, you want to enable comments by connecting a discussion group. This is done by double-clicking the channel name and scrolling down to the discussion link. Follow the instructions and a group will be created that allows your followers to comment on posts in the channel and have conversations among themselves. Both Telegram groups and channels provide the ability to pin multiple posts. This can be used for setting discussion rules or to list links to resources. In addition to text messages, you can post photos, videos, or polls by clicking the paperclip icon to the left of the text field. All of these media types can be embedded into web pages to share with a wider public. And you can get your groups and channels jump started by sending invite links to your contacts or sharing them online. These links can also be converted into QR codes, which can then be printed onto posters, business cards, or stickers. In the phone version of the app, you can also create location based groups. This is done by clicking contacts, find people nearby, create local group. This will make your group visible to anyone who has location service enabled in the area. So imagine you're trying to organize resistance to a government policy and Facebook and Twitter have made it clear that speaking out against this policy will not be tolerated on their platforms. Rather than trying to sneak past them, which is not likely to work, you create a Telegram channel. In that channel, you pin your manifesto or information about your event to the top and send an invite link to your contacts. You also make a post on your normal social media profiles, sending people to your channel. Next, you make posters, business cards, and stickers with your message plus a QR code. You also post PDFs for these printouts into the channel and encourage your subscribers to distribute them. You then create a network of local and regional groups moderated by people you trust. This enables people to organize their own events in their respective towns. Rinse and repeat and your movement will grow. Social media companies won't be able to stop you. In fact, they won't even have information about your activities. They will be completely out of the loop. And that's a good thing because it also cuts government surveillance out of the loop. Now the Stormclouds Gathering channel has survived the social media purge so far because we've been very careful not to cross certain lines. There are certain things we cannot talk about here or will be taken down. However, in this next phase, some of these lines need to be crossed and we'll be crossing them on Telegram. We're going to be posting content there which will not be available on our other platforms. In fact, if you join the Stormclouds Gathering channel on Telegram today, you'll find a new video that will never ever be posted to YouTube or Facebook. You can also follow us on BitChute at bitchute.com forward slash channel forward slash Stormclouds Gathering. This content is Creative Commons. 
You have permission to download, copy, and distribute by any and all means. If you appreciate our work, you can donate at stormcloudsgathering.com forward slash donate. You can also send Bitcoin directly to the address below. Now, before we go, I have a special announcement. Right now, I'm accepting applications for a long-term apprenticeship slash collaboration on-site at our off-grid center in the Commonwealth of Dominica. This person will eat with us, work with us, and I will teach them everything I know. This will cover technical skills like video editing, audio recording, and writing, but it will also involve a deep dive into crowd psychology, history, and philosophy. Working with us, you will also develop a number of practical skills as well. Organic farming, construction, terracing, water management, soil science, and more. Those interested will find more information at stormcloudsgathering.com forward slash the Dread Pirate Roberts.